Hey there, I'm Michael. I teach people about Python on the internet. Recently, I made a video about using PyScript, this new ability to run Python in the same place you would run JavaScript in the browser, and showing how we can use offline progressive web apps to make it run really fast and feel great, basically like an installed application. But do you know what? It turns out that iOS, iPad and iPhone and so on, support progressive web apps. So what if we had PyScript on one hand, iPad on the other, could we bring these together to basically create a Python based local application? It turns out we can. And in this super short video, I'm going to show you how to do it. Here we are on my iPad. Notice that we have our PyScript progressive web app right in the dock, just like any other iOS app. When we launch it, it takes just a couple of seconds to load PyScript, and run our Python code to get the weather from our API. This is all happening locally on iPad. I'm exposing the web app over ngrok on my Mac. If you take a look over there, during the launch, notice there are no requests for any PyScript or PyDide binaries because they were installed into iOS when we installed the progressive web app. All you see are API calls, which is exactly what we want. So what do we need to do to install our website as an offline app in iOS? Notice it's open in Safari here. Just click share and then add to home screen and we'll have it ready to run as a PWA. Now, when we launch it the first time, it'll take a moment because it's downloading all the PyScript and PyODide runtimes And then it's up and running. But on the next run, it's nearly native app fast because all of those Python runtime files are already installed. How cool is that? So there you have it. What do you think? Pretty awesome? I think so. It certainly opens up additional possibilities for creating apps that kind of work like native apps on iOS and even Android. If you want to see how this is all put together and really dive into PyScript and Python, check out my video, which I'll put a link right there. So you can go visit it. I'll put a link in the description below as well. Play around with PyScript. Let me know what you think. Add some comments. Exciting? Not interesting? Too slow? Fast enough? We're almost there, I think. But I'm not sure we're quite there. It's very exciting to see the progress, though.